it's almost like I can't explain it. That's like everybody that's in your like row of buildings, everybody is like family. Everybody looks out for one another. Like when I'm not home, you know, my neighbor, you know, watches over my house. And it's your townhouse will not be prone to be broken into because there's so many eyes, you know, by you. So that's one pro. Burglars won't try to, you know, come in your house and rob you. Um, another pro is you don't have to do any yard work. No outside maintenance. If you were to have a house, you would have to do all of that. On top of getting your house pressure washed, the HOA, um, the HOA covers all of that. So they'll do your yard work maintenance and um, your building maintenance and your roof maintenance when you need it. Um, the cons I can say is when you want to have a function at your house there's not many spots for parking that's one con I really don't like is there's no parking <laughs> there's no parking for like functions people have to park like on the side of the road in the community or whatever and some HOAs don't allow that so that all depends on where you go you know to buy your house with the HOA uh, want you to do another con is having to pay your HOA fee every month some townhome communities their HOA fees are reasonable and some are outrageously expensive because of I guess the location and what they do in the HOA fee some HOA fee includes like your trash and water outside maintenance and stuff like that and, and those ones are really high um but mine just you know includes the outside maintenance and that's it so mine is not that expensive at all so mine is like 75 dollars a month which is very reasonable um i'm trying to think if there's any other cons i wouldn't say there's any other cons i mean um, I don't really, I don't hear my neighbors at all because my, um, the walls in our units are, um, soundproof, so you can't hear. So, you know, they can be screaming next door or have the music loud and I wouldn't, I can't hear them, which is good. Um, but it all depends on where, where you look at. I would say just take your time. You know, write your list out of everything that you want in the house and go from there and go look at go look at every single townhouse and in your area and see what everybody is offering and, and you go from there. But if I can turn back the hands of time I would I would buy still buy a townhouse again because it's very convenient for me being a single woman not being married. I don't have no husband to do no yard work and stuff for me. So I think it's very convenient. Um, if y'all have any other questions, leave them down below. I'm on my way home. My brother and my dad painted the rest of the downstairs area and I'm anxious to see what they did. I really hope that it's they did not damage anything in there because they kind of reckless. So we will see. I will definitely show you once I get home. So hang on tight. And when I get back home, I'll show you what they did yesterday. It looks so good. I'm standing in my foyer. But... I think I did a good job picking this paint color. It is called Agreeable Gray. My house looks a total mess. I guess they didn't damage my stuff too much. 
looks really good. See how this kitchen looks. Oh my lord. It looks so good. Now all they have to do is do the um paint the trim and we are good. It looks so good. Yes, I'm loving it. <laughs> Can y'all hear the excitement in my voice? Well, I will see you guys on the next video. Bye.